Hi, I'm Michelle from Michelle's Romantic Tangle, and today I am showing you the best of Teresa Wensler Fantasy Collection. This is one of her out-of-print collections of patterns. It is sadly the only one in my stash. While I was playing around online yesterday, I discovered that there's a Best of Teresa Wensler Fantasy Collection Volume 2, a Christmas collection, and a sampler collection. Although, like I said, they're all out of print, and I don't have hopes of acquiring any of them myself, except you never know what you might find in the thrift shop. I bought my copy back when I was first cross-stitching, when it was still in print, and I think I probably got it at Joann's with a 40% off coupon. The book has a article about Teresa Wensler and her creative process, which I did find very interesting. The first chart is Rapunzel. This is one that I dream of someday stitching. Realistically, I don't know if that's going to happen, but we don't have to be realistic. This is Day. Night. Magical Night. Carousel. This one has some fantastic detail with those flowers and the horses. The Castle Sampler. The alphabet is there. It goes around the outer border, and then the numbers are along the bottom. The details of this one are just wonderful. I love all the greenery. Stroke of Midnight, another one of the charts that, in my someday when I have all the time and all the patience, the castle. This, from my quick research this morning, is the only design in this book which is not available currently from, I believe, the company is PatternsOnline.com. Pegasus. I would love to stitch this one. Unicorn. Again, one that I would like to stitch. And that is it for the 10 designs in the book. The charts are black and white. They're fairly small, so you'd need to... I at least would need to enlarge them. There are lots of blended threads and... Not all of the charts include over one sections, but many of them do, which is another of the things that makes me think twice. The reason I, my inspiration for pulling this one out today is that earlier this week I was at the thrift shop and saw this in with all of the framed pictures. That, my friends, is a fully stitched Teresa Wensler. I knew from the pictures on the charts I own that her stuff was gorgeous. I had never seen one in real life. And I am just enamored with it. I'll probably stitch one of these some of the one of these one of these days. I'm not in a hurry. A lot of my cross stitch stash is kind of aspirational things that I want to someday stitch. Again, the book is the best of Teresa Wensler Fantasy Collection. It is out of print and not terribly affordable. Most of the designs are available legally from other sources, except for the cover design with the dragon. I hope that you've enjoyed this video. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll be back with you soon.